overthinking this whole YouTube thing. And I think it's because we always feel like we need to be doing something that isn't boring. Yeah, do you know what? I think we forget that a lot of you guys literally just watch us <laughs> because you support us and you want, you just want to watch us doing what we do, whatever that may be. Isn't that right? So Mummy's by herself this morning. We're gonna do a realistic couple of days. We're gonna try and bring you along for more or less everything and show you exactly what we do in a couple of days, isn't that right? But um, Connor's usually the cameraman, so... Mummy's not very good. <laughs> yeah, Mummy's not very good with the camera. So Connor is at the salon currently, which is why we're alone. He's gone blonde and I've just had a text and they've apparently, because usually he just gets the top blonde when he when he used to go blonde. Uh, apparently they've convinced him to do the whole thing blonde. I'm looking forward to seeing that. I'm not sure how it's gonna look. Slightly concerned. And I wanna get your reaction when daddy comes home. Will Cozy recognize Connor with full on blonde hair? Do you think you're gonna recognize daddy? He's had his first feed. But now it's time for mummy to have a coffee, is that okay? Why are you just staring at the camera? Oh my gosh, you're so photogenic, aren't you? Get my good angle, please, mummy. Get my good angle. Let's see your Christmas, babe. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Baby, mum, look at all the mess you've left. is it and I'm still in my pajamas let's have a look it's 20 to 12 and I'm still looking like this but in all fairness he didn't wake up till half nine this morning so and then he took ages to eat his breakfast didn't you little man here is my POA quickly drink my coffee while cozy is happy in his bouncer I might put some plim plim on he likes plim plim I'm gonna quickly eat this this is not on my new healthy lifestyle plan but there is nothing in and I don't want to order food because it's very, very expensive. So we need to go shop so I can prepare for all of my meal plans. And then I want to clean the house. It's not as bad as it usually is, but it is, it's quite messy. I want to maybe get ready. A shower realistically, but maybe that's going to have to be when Connor gets home because I can't shower and dry my hair and look after him. <laughs> I probably could if I was really desperate, but that sounds stressful. Maybe put some makeup on. Definitely want to get dressed today and might attempt to go for a workout, possibly. <laughs> Try. I just don't, I don't even know what time Connor's gonna be home. Anyways, we're gonna put on, we're gonna put some telly on, okay, baby boy? And I'm gonna quickly try and eat and drink this. Cozy likes friends. He was just sat with Connor the other day. Literally just sat there watching friends together. <laughs> So, Mummy's gonna try and clean. Maybe you go for a nap and then we can have some foodies, okay? I always have to watch myself while I do the wrap just to make sure I do it properly. Oh, oh, sorry about that. Oh, it's on your head. Oh no, silly Mummy. Oh gosh, right. A lot of you have been asking me how to do this, so if anyone's interested, you, you find the middle, it goes round your middle, cross it over, up and over your shoulders. So this one goes over this shoulder, this one goes over this shoulder. I never know how tight I need to do it. It usually depends like what kind of clothing we have on. Because if he's in a jumper, sometimes I can do it too tight. You cross these over, hold that, and you want to push that under the waist one. If it uncrosses, just cross it again. It goes round the back and round the forward, round the forward. And then you just want to do a bow. Are you ready? Wah! You want to hold him, this leg under here, and then it wants to go into this waist one as well. But that's it, don't want to put him in that one. Same on this side, ready? That leg, like that. And then I go for this one first. So we're going to make sure that that's all the way around the bum bum. Oh, mum's done it the wrong way around. So we mummy. Make sure, get your arm in. Get off my hair! And this one, and then this one goes over his bum bum, like this. And then you need to make sure that you can kiss his head. Like a little chicken. And then when he goes for a nap, this kind of like goes over his head, but I think I might have done it a bit too tight, maybe. And I just like to double check that his legs are being held up properly. Very nice little boy! Oh my gosh! Should we go and do some cleaning then? You're gonna help me, come on.
decided he doesn't want to be in the carrier anymore. And your baby boy, he's getting a bit annoyed. I think he's starting to get hungry. I've just knocked my coffee everywhere. This is going extremely well for mummy. Doing so well, you're hungry. Gonna have to change your nappy, make your bottle. Maybe mummy can get a drink of water. Would that be okay? But look what you can do now. Ready? Are you gonna be in the mood to do it? Ready? Tripod arms, ready? Tripod arms, tripod arms. <sighs> Clever boy. Whoop. Oh, where did we go? Silly sausage. And he started doing this himself because I used to lay him against the pillows upstairs and he'd like bring himself forward. You must have amazing strength, Mr. Boy. Clever boy. Oh, where are you going? Wow. Oh, clever boy. You're so strong. Where are you going? No, you can't eat that. Honestly, if you're a single parent, you are a superhero. I. <laughs> Genuinely don't know how you do it. Even having like odd days where I have to look after baby by myself, it is so hard. Like it's hard with two of you, but to do it by yourself, like you're amazing. And I feel so guilty as well because he's such a heavy baby. Last time he was weighed, and this was like over a month ago, he was 18 pounds, which is like heavier than the regular baby. No, sorry, no, obviously it's like heavier than the regular baby. Sorry, I haven't drank all my coffee. He is heavier than the typical one year old. Like I'm assuming he's like 20 something pounds now. For me to be able to get stuff done, especially if I'm by myself, I have to put him down because my arm can only take so much. Even when I put him in the carrier, the backache. I'm only a weak little girl. The backache is real and I feel so guilty about it sometimes because I don't want to have to put him in a chair while I do stuff. I want to be able to hold him and have him do stuff with me, which is why obviously when I've got Connor, it's so much easier. I can hold him while he cleans the kitchen or gets stuff done and vice versa. We can work while one of us is looking after him and interacting with him. A lot of mum guilt in that area because he's just so heavy and I struggle. I just, I struggle. But mummy's, mummy does have stuff to do, doesn't she, baby boy? But even like making his bottle is really hard holding him. But I have got like little tips, maybe. I've got a magic prep, but we've, I can't find the lid, so I've just put a piece of tissue on it for now, excuse that. What I was noticing is when I was shaking his formula, there was still little clumps in his milk, which is really, really bad. So. We prep like these the day in advance. I haven't prepped them yesterday because we were in a rush and Connor left this morning so we didn't have any clean bottles, but I cleaned two this morning. So I've got a fresh bottle ready to go. It's already sanitized everything. And then I usually have these throughout the day. We'll have all the clean bottles and all of them. So you literally put the bottle in and then you put this in and you just pour it in. It's all, it's all measured and everything ready. So you don't even have to worry about it. <laughs> Straight away, he knows exactly what it is. What's it? Oh, I know, I know, but you can't quite change your nappy, little boy. Ready? You know what happens after we change your nappies, don't you be silly? So, Connor just let me know that he's on his way home a lot quicker than mummy thought. Probably because they've done like his whole hair blonde, so they didn't have to sit there and foil it. They've literally just blonded it all. I'm very excited. I'm gonna set up the camera now, ready for when he walks in, so we can get our reactions. Because sl I'm slightly concerned. I don't, I don't know what, what it's gonna look like. I've never seen him full on blonde, and I want to see if you recognise him. So we're gonna finish his bottle, and then as soon as he pulls up, I'll get the camera on. Woo! And then maybe I can go for a shower. Kid you not, I was literally just setting up the camera. He's pulled up. I can't look out of this window. He's parked here, so I've got to make sure I don't look. Oh my god, cozy daddy's home. Daddy's home and he's full blonde. Oh my gosh. Don't look out of the back window, cozy, okay? I better make sure this door's open for him. He's taking his time. I can hear him in the parcel box. Oh, I think I've just seen him past the window. He's coming. Oh, I'm nervous now. Oh. oh my. You look like something out of a boy band. That's what I was going for. I said make me look like a boy bander. <laughs> Do you know what? It doesn't look as bad as I thought it was gonna look. This is like a nice gem head. It doesn't look as bad. I don't particularly... You have to wait a couple of weeks before yeah, the looks for out. Was that the easiest option? Yeah. Do you want to show the camera? Yeah. Hello, I'm ah! just gem head. Nice to see you. <laughs> I'm gem head. Are you spilt coffee? Oh yeah. 
Uh, yeah, I still haven't picked that up. No, yet. I can see it there. Here were monkey Here man. Is it cozy? Here were laffy pants. <gasps> I got a lovely head massage. Did you? Mm. I'm jealous. Mummy, can I have a shower? Again? <laughs> Hello, this is Daddy and Cozy reporting for filming. So Mummy's in the shower and we're sitting here about to read Peekaboo, which is a very thrilling book that Cozy adores and that I love reading to him, of course. I find it so strange looking at myself now. I'm blonde. It doesn't even look like me. Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird, isn't it? <coughs> oh no! What did I do? What's wrong, baby boy? You want to read Peekaboo? <coughs> baby see the ocean. A pointy starfish. A whale's tail. Oh my goodness. Guess who? Peekaboo! A bumpy, bubbly octopus. He couldn't be less interested. Should we watch some Plim Plim? <laughs> Connor has taken baby so I can have a shower. And I slept in my hair and I think I've got knots in it because I slept in it wet and I can feel like a massive knot at the back of my head. So this might not be good. <laughs> yeah, I think I've definitely got knots in here. <laughs> the fun of having curly hair. <sighs> I think I got it. What you got? <laughs> oh, you dropped it. Look and listen. Yay! What's this one? What are you doing though with your feeties? Go and then press it. Nearly. <gasps> clever boy. You're so clever. Can Cozy play? Oh my gosh! Oh, clever boy! Yay! You did it! Oh my gosh! And now for the bit that takes forever. Also, look what came today. I finished with my hair. I was like, um, sorry, I only ordered one of these, I swear. So I had to check. They saw my video and they sent me a free pair. Can I rock brown? That is a good question. Probably not, let's be honest. But I'm gonna try them. I don't know what you wear with this. Maybe I'll put my Christmas jumper back on. I'm gonna get Connor's reaction. Hello, mummy. The other one suits you like perfectly. This one, not so much. It yeah. also looks a bit tighter. Yeah, I think they're a smaller size. Yeah. I can't wear um, like a baggy jumper with it or anything. The other one's still cute though. We've had a nice time. Have you? We just played piano. <gasps> did Daddy play it or did Cozy play no, it? he played some of it. He oh. did play some of it by himself. So we're going to go to the shop, aren't we? Sorry? I'm going to get ingredients because Connor's parents have been a lot of help, a lot of support, so... I want to make them some cookies. Oh, you're making them for them? Yeah! Oh. I mean, we can have one. And then we're going to go and get our food for tonight. And I've decided I'm just going to go in this because at least then I can carry them around the shop and then maybe I'll get myself some PJs. Liana's never been happier. 20% off all women's clothes, which means you get to get pajamas. Liana somehow dragged me into the equation. Mini pud. Mama pud. Papa pud. Family goals. I don't get a choice in these things. Welcome to Mummy and Cozy's Baking Show! Thank you, thank you. Woo! Thank you. Yeah! We have no idea what we're doing. Oh. Cozy was in his carrier, but he doesn't want to be in the carrier, so I don't know how I'm going to do this. Yeah! Yeah! Woo! And Daddy's going to go and get his matching PJs on! Yeah! yeah. Oh, do we have to? Mix together sugar, salt, and butter until paste. Hungry! You wanna help Mama with a little spoon? No, don't eat it. No? Okay. Nan and Grandma doing your slobber. 115 grams of melted. Okay, so we need to melt some butter, okay? Wow, look at that. You wanna help Mummy? You wanna stir it? Go on in, you stir it. Clever boy, yeah. Gosh, loud boy. So my assistant decided he was hungry and tired, so mummy went to make him bottle, and now Connor's doing the other half of the bottle so I can finish. I hope this isn't gonna ruin the cookies though. I've never made cookies before, only school cake. I'm a school cake pro. Right, well, here's the fun part because I forgot to buy baking powder. Ah! Chilled over for at least 30 minutes. Ah. I've just Googled and it says that I can use self raising flour instead if you need baking powder, so. 
I'm gonna do that because I have got some of that. So I was wondering how I only managed to make nine cookies. The recipe said I could make 12. <laughs> Cookie slabs! Hey, there's nothing wrong with cookie slabs. I think it's a good thing. You just had a right laugh at them! Obviously, it's funny, but it would still be nice. Would you eat a cookie what slab? What wrong? Oh my gosh. I'll still eat it. I don't care. Woo! Time for bed, little man. Well, not time for bed. It's bath time, actually. We're going to read a book. What have we got? Spot goes to the farm. That's what we're reading today. This is the new one that we bought, isn't it? And then... Going to your grandparents' house tomorrow, aren't you? And we'll give them my breeze block cookies that I made for them. I'm sure they'll absolutely love them. Oh, you're soaking, little boy. Spot goes to the farm. I have some baby animals to show you, Spot. Find them, Dad. Right, let's play try not to upset the baby whilst Mummy runs the bath. Okay, let's try and stay as happy as possible before the bath because you know how much you love the bath. It's nice and warm. You get to kick your little leggies. Oh, careful. We get to get you nice and clean under your little chin. You can make grunting noises. Yes. <laughs> Cozy darling, turn we're ready for you in the bath station. It's bath time. Hey, it's okay. Here it is, Billy. Here it is, here it is. Silly Billy. gonna pack mommy's gonna feed and then we're going to the grandparents house you're gonna take your little crab and we're gonna take your little crab on your book okay should we have some num nums then right we're packed and ready to go aren't we little man you got your hat on keep your little ears nice and warm we've got your coat we've got your books we've got outfits we've got nappies travel milks just in case and most importantly We've got Nana and Grandad slab cookies! There's a way to be chewy. Mummy's got your dodie. Are we in? Yep. We're in. Cozy's got a present for you. Oh! Cozy! <laughs> give that to Nana. Oh! Thank you! And give that to Nana. Oh! Very good. Clever boy. He's like, what have I just done? <laughs> What's just happened There's exactly? Some cozy, aren't they? Right, I'd just like to clarify, I know that I've spelt grateful wrong, but I didn't want to correct myself because I didn't want to ruin the colour. You've spelt grateful wrong? Yeah. Wow. That's bad from you because you're the spelling police when anyone gets it wrong in the you're chat. You're spelling police. Your mum's a spelling police. Mum and Carl, thank you for everything that you have done. Hold on, hold on. This is from Cozy Mum and Carl. <laughs> Us, but Cozy gave it. Oh, okay. It's neat, isn't it? We've been We're working on it. Grateful. Merry Christmas, love from Connor and Cozy. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> oh, oh my God. God. What is that? What is that? It's like toast. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like toast. <laughs> it does look like toast. It's okay. It was meant to be a cookie. <laughs> Connor said they were still nice, though. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's supposed to be a cookie, yeah, just... Cozy made it! Thank <laughs> you so much! He actually did, he used the spoon and he stirred it a little bit. So technically Cozy did make them. Wow, well, that's brilliant. Oh, no. I've got something better. There's something better than what you've just given them? Yeah. Wow, that must you be good. You want the baby or... Okay, what... Yeah. For, okay. Oh, this is the best thing ever! Yes. <laughs> Can we clear some room? The no, we'll, we'll do it in the other room. Okay, we'll do it in here, it's fine. Are you ready for this? On, I personally think this is going to be a fan favourite of this house. Well, has she actually made this? No, no I wish. This is a toy for Cozy, oh. that's fantastic. It's El Crabbo! <laughs> <laughs> but it gets oh, better! What does he do? <laughs> <laughs> no. I mean, I think I like it more than Cozy, 
that's it for today's video hope you enjoyed it and we will see you next week Bye.